Yo, welcome guys to another video of Nantis Tabs, in this case we are going to build a 300 euros PC. Let's go! Okay guys, so let's just start building this PC. First of all, we're going to start unboxing the motherboard, processor, and RAM. In this case, I have chosen an MSI B450, as you can see. Very good motherboard for the price. And for this build, it's going to fit perfectly. And yeah, I'm going to leave here the unboxing, and then we will we'll talk about the CPU. Now let's introduce the main character of this build, or in other words, the CPU. In this case, I picked the AMD Athlon 3000G for its price, which is $50 or 50 euros. It's very, very good. It has two cores for threads at 3.5 GHz and the graphics that are integrated are the Radeon Vega 3 GPU at 1100 milliards. With this CPU, we're going to be able to play games such as LoL, CSGO or Valorant. Very like the games because for its price, this is what you're getting. So if you're thinking of buying this PC, keep in mind that it's not for gaming. Well, it is for light gaming but mainly is for working with, for example, at work or school, with the office, Google Chrome, um, similar programs. Now let's talk about the RAM, which is 8GB at 3200 mHz. There are two slots for four, so we take advantage of the dual channel. And yeah, it's very important for this, well, in general for Ryzen and AMD CPUs, 
the speed of the RAM, they will work much much better. And also it is very important the amount of RAM in this uh, APUS because the GPU of the AMD CPU needs at least 2 GB of RAM. So we are going to get uh, 6 GB of, of RAM for our programs and games. So very important to pay a little bit of more money in the RAM because it's going to be very important. I'm just going to unbox this huge modular PCU by Antec. So yeah, let's go. Let's tear down this plastic. Whoa! Here we have this for cable management. Whoa! I'm very happy they include this. Instructions. Check this out. Yeah, it, it seems like a very luxury product by Antec. And here, as you can see, we have all the cables. Very, very, very nice. So, yeah. Now let's move to the SSD, which I choose the Crucial because it seems very nice for its price. And as you can see, is the 120 gigabytes one and um, well I will put in the description the 241 gigabytes because for five euros more you have more space and at the start is much much better but don't worry if you think this is, this is not enough space because you can put an HDD of one tera terabyte which is going to work very good so I'm going to leave a short time lapse of the build and later we will talk about the highlights of the NX220. Always going, all this why they call me no one. Yeah. Go ahead, run 
بشه بر And the final part, the Antec NX220. This case for this price is very very good. You got, as you can see, a lot of space. At the top, you got this dust filter for your 120 millimeters fan. And in the front, we have three USBs, the ports for the headsets, and as you can see, the power button and even more a reset button. Now, at the front, what we can see, you have this LED strip, which you can change the colors with that small button that is right there, as you can see. And you have plenty of modes, red, green, and different cool lighting settings. Here at the side, we have like this kind of mess that looks very, very dope. And as you can see, we have this huge window to see the inside of the PC, which I think is kind of cool because it's like the premium cases. It's not a, it's not glass, but it seems great so yeah let me know in the comments what do you think about my view and if you like this video please don't forget to subscribe and like and i see you in the next video